Chuck Wagon MTG is sponsored by BC Comics and Games. Hey everyone, thanks for joining us for another great video here on Chuck Wagon MTG. Today we got a lot of stuff to go over, so we're going to dive right in. First off, the contest that we normally run every week, where we give uh, a pack of cards to a random comment from one of uh, last week's videos. We're still going to be doing that, but today's video is already packed full enough, and we like to keep the videos under 25 minutes. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to do a special episode this coming Sunday, the 30th. Um, where we're essentially just going to be giving packs away. We're going to throw some other stuff in there too, but that's the main purpose of the video. Um, next thing to go over, um, you may have noticed the beginning of all of our videos and at the end, uh, you see us mention BC Comics and Games. Um, BC Comics and Games, I've been going there for uh, somewhere around 10 years. Um, it is, hands down, the greatest store I have ever been in. Not just because of you know the product and all the stuff they carry, um, the fact that they carry lots of magic and comic stuff, that's a big bonus, um, but a lot of it was because of the community that they helped build and nurture. Um, it's just, it's second to none. Um, unfortunately, BC Comics will be closing their doors. Um, as of January, uh, BC Comics will be closed, uh, and so they will no longer be sponsoring us. Um, I just want to say real quick that it was an absolute honor and privilege to be sponsored by BC Comics and Games. Um, specifically, Bob and Shannon, the owners, are amazing people, and um, I was, I am just extremely thankful that they uh, saw enough in this channel to put their money, you know, essentially where their mouth was. Uh, and support us. Um, so for that, I greatly thank you, and you will be missed uh, terribly, absolutely terribly. Um, I don't think we'll ever find another community quite like BC Comics. But, alas, we are going to uh, attempt, uh, so we are looking for new sponsorship, and we're going to keep everyone updated on that uh, as the months go on. Uh, next thing we got, we have a push for subscribers. We're going to be doing some giveaways. You may have seen some of the posts we made here over the last week. Well, here are the details for it. I actually have them written down because I forget stuff very easily. So, essentially, we've got a whole bunch of prizes, and each prize has a subscriber goal tied to it. Our first goal is going to be 700, which isn't too far away from where we're currently at, so uh, this one should fire rather quickly. Uh, we're going to open five packs of Guilds of Ravnica uh, on the channel, and then one lucky winner is going to win the uh, rares and the mythics or whatever, you know, the shinies, the good stuff inside those packs. Then, once we hit 800 subscribers, we're going to be giving away a Kefnet invocation and a Nicobolas, the Planeswalker dude. He is all sorts of fun and a bun, and that's going to be what we're giving away at 800. Now at 900, we are going to be giving away a Karn. Scion of Urza and a Guilds of Ravnica Fat Pack, which we're going to open, and you're going to get the good stuff out of that too. And then we're not done quite yet. At a thousand subscribers, one lucky winner is going to receive a Liliana of the Veil. Vale. And then just to make this a little bit better, we've got a our top goal of 1,500 subscribers. At that moment, we'll go ahead and launch on Gleam to pick the winner to get a full booster box of Ravnica Allegiance. Um, we're going to, same thing, open it. Uh, you'll get all the rares and the foils and all the good stuff out of it. And we'll go ahead and mail them to you. Uh, so that's what we're doing here. Now, essentially, once again, we have to hit these subscriber goals to trigger off these little uh, mini contests, if you will. So uh, share this video uh, far and wide. Share the channel, because the sooner we hit those goals, the sooner we can give this stuff away. And then we're not going to be done. Once we hit 1,500, we've got more stuff in the work. So there's going to be more stuff coming. It's going to be it's fun and a bun, I'm telling you. All right, now, uh, for, now that we got that out of the way, let me move my notebook here. Um, we are going to do some of our Patreon uh, pack openings here, but first we're going to add to the box. So let's go ahead and we'll get this out. Here we go. Um, 
There we go. Now we're thinking. I the camera wasn't on. Anywho, okay. So we got a fresh box here that we are gonna crack open. Alrighty. So we'll go ahead and do this. Three. Uh, what do we got here? That's yeah, that's five packs. Let's go ahead and do that. We'll go ahead and do five packs. Um, essentially, what we're going to do is all of the good stuff in these packs is going to go into our Patreon build a pack box. Now, the commons will not go in there right now so because the box is kind of full uh, and we don't have room. We are switching to a bigger box because we just need to now. So, But we're going to go ahead and skip through all this and then see if there's anything good. No. Sinister Stabitage, not bad. And then we got a Mausoleum Secrets. That will go into the rare spot. Um, I should, I'm trying to remember what that's worth. I don't. It might not be worth. I don't know. We'll see. So, if you're interested in becoming a patron, you can check out the link down below. We've got lots of good stuff in there. Uh, lots of good tiers. It's all sorts of fun. So, uh, no, no, no. We got Thief of Sanity, and then we got a foil vicious rumors that card right there that card's nuts for one black mana it does so much it is so good i mean it's not really a like a tier one good but if you're drafting that thing is nuts if you're in two-headed giant that card is bonkers okay cavalier unicorn lotleth giant and dawn of hope no real big hits. Alright. Uh, we got a field. We got out of focus. That's what we got. There we go. House Guild Mage, Imp, and a Tajik. I like that guy. Um, I built a couple decks around him. He's fun. Um, Kind of easy to kill him, but, I mean, I'm not going to be that uh, dice to bullet guy. So, all right, we got another Cavalier, that guy, we Dragonauts, and a Pelt Collector. Okay, oh, we got a foil. Man, I thought we got a foil steam vent. Guildgate. Um, you know, we didn't open anything really great. So we're going to grab one more pack. All right, let's get something good here. Guild Mage, Price, Creeping Chill, and you know, Chromatic Lantern, it's, I guess, could be worse. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and stick these over here. The, those commons will be going into the uh, Build-A-Pack box eventually, but not right now. We'll go ahead and sleeve these up. Um, no, I'm not going to sleeve that. That's just going to go in the common slot. Dawn of Hope. I've seen some interesting stuff built with Dawn of Hope. I really have. We'll throw that in there too. Um, Sinister Sabotage. I think that's still over a buck. You know, let me double check. Let me just double check really quick. That is not. Okay, so that's not going to go into our common or our uncommon uh, worth at least a buck or more slot. That would not be right. Okay, so we got these sleeved up. I'm going to go ahead and bring our box over here. And then this is our just our couple foils in that uh, Sinister Sabotage. Gonna randomly insert. Man, this thing is packed full. I cannot wait to move to that new box. That is full. Okay, then we're gonna take these rares here. We're gonna take them with the rares that are in the box. And we're just gonna mix them on in. 
Uh, we actually were we're gonna be having in the somewhat near future um, uh, a new way to contribute to this box. I'm gonna give it a whirl, see how it works out, and then we'll kind of go from there. All right, so. All right, so our Build-A-Pack box is set up. Now, for our first Patreon, we have Eric Birch. Thank you very much sir, for being a Patreon. It is greatly appreciated. Your support is, well, it's, it's direly needed at this channel. We couldn't do the stuff that we like to do if you didn't support us. So we're going to go ahead and grab one, two. Now, what Eric is getting here is he's getting two rares. He's getting a come or uncommon worth at least a buck or more. He's getting a random foil card, a random foil basic land, and then ten cards out of this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, and ten. All right, let's see what he got in the common slash uncommon spot. Oh, I flipped a foil. My bad. And I flipped it. Well, we already saw it. So uh, the the basic land you got that's foil is an M14 planes. And then we got ourselves a John Sphinx, Knight of Infamy, Centaur Peacemaker, Hooting Mandrels, uh... Cinder Crawler, that's kind of nice. Uh, Plume Veil, we got Arms Dealer, we got Menagerie, <clears throat> excuse me, Liberator, uh, we got a Foil Two Headed Zombie, and then we got a Thermo Alchemist. All right, Random Foil is a Foil Hero's Blade, that's not too bad. Common or Uncommon Worth, at least a buck, we got a Liliana's Caress, that's nice. Our first rare is a clone from, was that, 13? All right. And then we got a Mausoleum Secrets, one of the cards we just pulled. All righty. Let's go ahead and see what we have in our packs here. All right. We got a True Fire Captain, no. Assassin, no. Rampaging Monument, no. And we got... Uh, expansion and explosion. We'll go ahead and yeah, we'll just, there we go. We'll just put it all in the same pile. Alrighty. Let's see what we get in the second pack here. Alright, we got a Molder Hulk that's out of focus. No? Yes? Come on. Sometime today, buddy. This camera is. <laughs> oh well. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to roll with it. There we go. Uh, we got Chemistry's Insight. That's not bad. Monument, and we got a citywide bust. All right, Eric. There, those are your cards. There. Thank you very much for being a patron. It is greatly appreciated. Next up, we have Jeffrey Peters. Same thing, two packs of cards. And he's getting two foils. All this for ten bucks, too. Uh, common or uncommon worth at least a buck. That, so we're getting slim there. That's one of the things we're going to have to add to. Uh, foil. Foil basic. Is that one or two? That's one. Okay, and then we got one, two, three. Seven, eight, nine, and last one, ten. All right. Let's see what uh, what Jeffrey got here today. We're not going to show off the stuff where we're supposed to. All right. We got a Torches Fiend, uh, Augur of Bolas, uh, Trigon of Corruption. That's always fun. Uh, Epicure of Blood, High Spire Artisan. Uh, Robe of Mirrors, I, I actually like that card a lot. Uh, Machino Pyromancer, we got uh, Mephetic Vapors, 
mirror servitor and a chain lightning that's, that's not too shabby all right let's see what we got here foil basic is uh, m19 uh, island random foil is a foil bone picker that guy was actually up there for a little bit common or uncommon worth at least a buck we got go for the throat first rare is a predatory rampage i like that card and our next one is Insidious Will. All right, let's get into the packs. See, what we're going to pull for Jeffrey here. Once again, we'll skip that. Oh, almost skipped too far. All right, uh, nothing good. Chemist's Insight, that's not too bad. Uh, enhanced Surveillance. And then we got, hey, Aurelia Exemplar of Justice. And we got a Foil Chromatic Lantern. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. That's how we do it. That is how we do it. Foil, rare, and a mythic in the same pack. Good stuff. All right, let's see what we got in pack two. Let's see if we can top that. It's going to be rough, though. That's going to be rough. Uh, we got Gargoyle, no. Spybug, no. Swarm, no. And then we got a Camaraderie. Okay, there we go. Well... Congratulations, that was, uh, that was pretty, pretty good. Congratulations very much, Jeffrey. Once again, thank you for your patronage. Next up, we'll get Joel Sudnahofsky. Thank you very much for being a patron. Two pence, two rares. If I can get them, there we go. Common run common. Foil. Foil Basic. Is it? Okay, I keep feeling like I'm grabbing two there, but I'm not. Alright, so we got... We'll do one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Oh, we got two there. Nine and ten. Alright, let's see what we're going to get. For Mr. Sednahovsky. There we go. All right. We got ourselves uh, Angel's Mercy, uh, Bull Rush Bruiser. We got a Veiled Shade, Swords to Plowshares. That's not too bad. Snap. Very nice. And our little staple there Public Execution. Uh, we got a Trooper. We got Knight of Infamy. We got a spider, and then we got uh, Death's Head Buzzard. Uh, that's some. Let's see if we can do this without messing up Zoom, of course. There we go. That's some nice stuff right there. All right, our foil basic is. Oh, we got uh, Mirrodin Swamp. Nice. Get some good stuff out of the box in this one. Uh, we got Mind Sculpt as our random foil. Ah, I messed it up. Um, let's see, we got a Pemmins Aura, I think that's how it's pronounced, is our, our coming on, coming worth at least a buck. If it's not worth at least a buck, we'll go ahead and replace it for you. Um, all right, we got ourselves a stomping ground. That's kind of nice. And then our next rare is, oh, Temple Garden. Well, I guess you're just getting all sorts of lands today. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and see what we got in the packs. Okay, uh, Gargoyle, Route. Just focus. That would just be so wonderful if you'd focus. All right, well, hey, we got a Steam Vents and a full Street Riot. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Not too bad. I actually love Street Riot. I, it's, I, that's just, that's such a wonderful card. I mean, it has definitely an EDH feel to it, but it's still pretty nice. Um, and for anyone who plays Arena and has not used the code yet, play Ravnica. Just enter that in. Um, I think pretty much everyone has done that. But if you haven't, there it is for you. All right. Night Vale Predator, Raiders, Sundu, and... Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Got another mythic out of the box. March of the Multitudes. 
thought we had a foil there for a second. All right, well, your packs did not turn out too Like I said, your patronage is greatly appreciated. All right, on to our next person. Who do we got next on my list? We have uh, Jordan Williams, uh, MTG Perfect, is, is who we got there. We got two packs. We got two rares. Common or uncommon? Worth at least a buck. Foil. Foil basic. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Last one for ten. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh, Titanic Growth, again, Demir Guildgate, uh, Attendant Knight, uh, the foil, is it Guildgate? I believe we just, that's the same one we just pulled. Maximize Velocity, Tormenting Voice, Pyroclasm, that's kind of nice. It's got, oh, it's got some dings in it, that's why it's in there. Still a good card. Uh, we got Revive, we've got Cartouche of Knowledge, and a Wojek Bodyguard. All right, let's see what you got for your foil basic winner, winner, chicken dinner. Two of the old ones in a was it in a row? Well, we've pulled two this video. Uh, anyways, you got yourself a nice swamp there. Random foil is a foil acidic slime. That's kind of fun. Common or uncommon? We got a capsize. Nice little staple-ish thing there. First rare is history of banalia. Look at that winner, winner, chicken dinner. And then we got ourselves a Narco Amoeba. Man, patrons are knocking it out of the park. Tell you what, the last patron video this whole month has been filled with really good patron polls. I am digging it. All right, let's skip to the end here. We're going on, oh, we're over 20 minutes, my goodness. Night Vale, Raiders, Enhanced Surveillance, and a Temple Garden. All right, rock right on. This is just getting better and better. I think the Temple Garden is the cheapest out of all of them, but still, it's... Hold on to it, it'll be worth something. We got a Crater Maker, uh, Thought Erasure, Flight, Overgrown Tomb. I guess this just lands, that's what you're doing. And we got a Foil Torch Courier as well. Look at that. Well, uh, I hope you're happy with your This one gives you it. greatly appreciated. Uh, for being a patron, uh, yeah, that worked out kind of nice. All right, next up, we have got Kevin Wheeler, another great patron of ours. He's actually been a patron for quite some time. We're going to grab him two rares. We're going to grab him a foil. We're going to grab him a common or uncommon, or at least a buck. We're not going to skip that, I promise. We're going to grab a foil basic, and we got one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, let's see what we can get, Mr. Kevin Wheeler. I'm not going to show these cards off, I promise. All right, we got a Chandra's Fury Beam Splitter Mage, Zombie Goliath. Goblin Electromancer, uh, Sacred Cat, you got that Foil Vicious Rumors that we just put in here, uh, Ranger's Path, Vigor Spore Worm, uh, Never Happened, and a Kraken Hatchling. Alright, let's see what we got here for a Foil Basin. Three today! Holy cats! Another, this is a Mirrodin's Plane. I don't think the, it was a Plains. Was it a Swan? I don't know. But another Mirrodin Foil Basic. Good stuff. All right. Uh, our foil, random foil, is Selective Snare. Common or uncommon, Crackling Drake. I think that's still over a buck. If it's not, we'll go ahead and replace it for you. All right. First rare is going to be Amera Soul of the Accord. Not too bad. And then a Chromantic Lantern. Let's see what we can get out of our packs. 
All right, skip, 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 skip. There we go. All right. No. 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 And we got a Niv Mizzet Perrin. All right, that's not too. And a foil Thoughtbound Phantasm. Man, we are doing some good stuff today. I am just, I am tickled. Pink. This is good stuff here. It really is. All right, skip past all that. Uh, Under City Necrolisk, Selective Snare, Goblin Banneret, and a Bounty Agent. All right, well, congratulations, Mr. <coughs> Kevin Wheeler. Uh, greatly appreciate you being here. You're going to put your stuff aside here. And, oh, we are already at 25 minutes. Okay, I got to hustle this. All right, we got. Um, MPG Unpack is next. Uh, he is at our booster pack here, our booster pack crew here. So he gets a pack of cards and a random foil basic. The foil basic is, uh, looks like an hour uh, forest. Now let's see what we got in this pack of his. All right, we got Murmuring Mystic. Boros Challenger Goblin Benaret and Amara Soul of the Accord. All right, rock on. That is your packs there, or pack there, uh, MTG Impact, which by the way, check out MTG Impact and MTG Hermit, both uh, really good channels um, with a lot of really cool stuff. All right, last but not least, we have Path to TCG, aka Kevin Chan, uh, who is our oldest. Let's see what we can get here. We got a foil basic, which is uh, Ixalan Forest. Not too bad. And let's see what we can get in his pack. Good, good stuff coming. I can feel it. Understudy Necrolisk, Flight of Equinauts, Grappling Sundew, and Unmoored Ego. Okay, I mean, it's not great, but... I've seen some interesting decks with it, so... All right, well, there you are. Thank you very much for being a patron. Thank all of you for being a patron. Uh, this has been an absolute blast as I knock the camera around. All right. Um, well, that about wraps it up. Please don't forget to check out our video Sunday. Uh, we'll be giving away some packs then. And then also don't forget about sharing this far and wide so we can get those tiers kicked off to start giving away prizes. Lots of good stuff. And, and, and all you got to do is watch, watch videos. I mean, that's good stuff. That sounds really good. Anywho, thank you all very much for watching. If you like what you saw here today, do us a huge favor. Click that like button. Be sure to hit subscribe and hit that bell notification button. Some new stuff coming out, you can know about it. Sounds great. Uh, don't forget you can find us on Facebook and Twitter, Chuckwagon MTG. This is normally the part where we would say, if you could just hold on for a brief second to hear a message from our sponsor, um, this will be the last time that, uh, that we do that. Uh, so if you could do us one huge favor and check out this brief message about our sponsor. Chuckwagon MTG is sponsored by BC Comics and Games, now at one mega location to fill all of your gaming and comic needs. They have Magic the Gathering events every night of the week, as well as Warhammer, Pathfinder, Dungeons and Dragons Adventures League, Final Fantasy TCG, Pokemon, and Star Wars X-Wing events all throughout the week. They also have close to 100,000 comics on site. This is why I have personally made BC Comics and Games my home gaming store.